And welcome back. This is Baller Scoop with an episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy 3. I'm joined, as always, by my trusty squad of Abel, Nova, Bloon, and Sackman. When we last left off, we were very close to the end of of uh, Eureka, the Forbidden Land in space. Now, we're going to try to finish it off. I shouldn't have too much trouble. You want to ignore that portal for now, just for now. And you want to grab this. What is it? It's another blade. I want it. I am Ragnarok, the demon blade. Let us test your strength and see if you are worthy. Ragnarok. I mean, we're just crossing all all kinds of mythologies here. Let's take on the Guardian, apparently. Same strategy as always. Go for Hiroga there. You go for a boost. Going with the Mass Moon and get 5,000 damage in. Always appreciated. Yeah, I mean, the, the boss fights in here, not nearly as tough as I was expecting, but uh, th the fact that they heal afterwards, that, that's really what's uh, what's making this easy. If this was just a regular boss run with no heals, this would be insane. Oh, and he casts Reflect. Damn you. You douche. Do I have... Spells, beneficial, magic. Let's go for that. Then uh, you can go for Kiraga, and you can go for a second boost. I'm not sure if Erase works on this guy. So I'm, I'm, I'm just trying it. Because if he casts Reflect, and then you use one of your powerful spells, then it is not good times for you. <laughs> not good times at all. The Kiraga is a little bit early. I was kind of hoping that he would attack first, but... He didn't. And he just uh, just attacks twice. Awesome. Let's go for an attack. Uh, this is kind of a risk, so I'm going for bio. And if it doesn't work, then it's just going to hit Novin. Uh, you need to attack this time. I did already use it twice. But hopefully... Don't, don't cast Reflect. Don't cast Reflect. Don't cast... Thank you. Oh, that would have been bad. And Abel is confused. That is not good. Go, Aroga. Luckily, Abel already got his attack in. And with Sackman going this time, we should be able to finish him off. Oh, great. A critical when we're already doing max damage. Thank you. Down goes Guardian. And we have obtained, I believe, the last sword. The last last ultimate weapon in this game. We get 16,500 gil, 7,900 experience, a level up for Bloon, and a job level up as well. And a level up for Sackman. We're climbing the levels. And we also get the Ragnarok. Excellent. The light is strong within you. I deem you worthy. Is that the only one that told us that we did a good job afterwards? I think it is. We get the Ragnarok. Yes, I will take it. And I don't think I will equip it because I can't, but I want to. Can I equip the Ragnarok? No, damn you. A ninja cannot handle it. There are other classes that can, but we'll get to those later. Probably in a bonus video, to be honest with you. But we're moving on. We're going to see what is up here through this portal. We get a couple more treasure chests. Awesome. Get a an elixir, another shuriken, another shuriken, and another elixir. Awesome. Nothing hap Nothing happens. Is that a revival spring? So then, the yeah, there we go. Full heal spring. Awesome. I will take it. And you, oh, <laughs> level eight magic. I want every last one of them. Flare, death, meteor, tornado, arise. Holy, I'll take all that I will equip every last one of them right now. Oh man, that is good stuff. Good stuff right there. Uh, you can also get the level six, se uh, level 6, 7, and 8 summons here. You can get as many of them as you want, uh, but I already have one, and one is enough because I will not have a summoner in my final party. I will show off the summons eventually, but we're not doing that in the, in the regular LP. We'll do that as a bonus video as well. Go over through this secret passage, 
and we can find another shop. This time, he has some of the best equipment in the game. Once again, not going for shields. I'm not going to go for shields, uh, but I do need for... I'm not going to be able to afford all this. Damn you. Okay, well, now I'm going to equip it anyway, so... I will have to do that once again in the bonus video. I'll, I'll have these guys equipped with uh, four. Yeah, I'll have these guys equipped with all this stuff I'll have. Damn it! I want money! I want more money! But I don't have it. So I'll have to got, buy all that stuff later off screen when I do have the money and I can actually use it. There's no point in getting it now if uh, if I can't use it and it's going to bankrupt me anyway. There is no warp out of Eureka. You just have to walk your way back and I will spare you guys that. So I will meet you outside. Okay, I teleported out of Eureka, which put me outside the Crystal Tower, walk, ran through the little entrance to the Crystal Tower again where the Earth Crystal was, and I'm back on the Invincible because it is time for more side questing. The last side questing and probably longest side questing of the game. What we need to do first is we actually do need to use Mognet. We need to use Mognet quite a bit. Uh, we're going to talk to Sarah a few times. Did she answer? She did! She is bored, be the princess is not all it's cracked up to be. I wish I could go on great adventures like you. Talk with, take me with you someday, all right? From Sarah. And now, I need to wait an hour so that I can message her again. I think it's been an hour, so let's talk to, to, the, to Moogle. Send Sarah something else. Sweet. She answered back so soon of late. Everyone in the castle has gone back to their daily routine after the djinn was banished. It's as if it never happened. I would like to thank you again for helping us. Have a safe journey! Another hour. It's been another hour. Let's let's talk and send more mail. Sarah. View mail. This help! My pendant broke today. No one in the castle was able to fix it. This pendant is very dear to me. Let me know if you meet someone who can help. I think I can help. So it is back to talk to Sarah. Do you remember where she was? Castle Sassoon? I'll show you. Okay, we're back on the floating continent. And here is Castle Sassoon. We need to talk to Sarah and have her give us her, her pendant because it needs fixing. Awesome! I swear this will all be worth it in the long run. I swear it. Into Castle Sassoon we go. And just like all good castles, you just go straight and eventually you will hit the king. Kings hate making turns. How dare you make them turn. Ever. So we just keep on going straight, and eventually we'll make it to the top. And shouldn't Sarah be like right here? She is not with the king. Damn it. Which way to Sarah's room? Usually it's just like one down. I've forgotten the layout of Castle Sasu. Please tell me it's not through a secret passage. Is it on the floor? Is it on the, the first floor? That looks like it should be it. Oh, you can rest there. Did not know that. No longer required now that I have the Invincible, but thank you. Oh, that's right. She's in, like, one of the towers, isn't she? Damn it, I have completely forgotten. It's the East Tower. I don't remember this being the one that had the enemies. I remember it being the West one, so hopefully the, the princess is up here. And I have not made a complete fool of myself. I have not. Sweet. Just a little bit, though. Just a little bit. Sackman, you've come. Sure he has. This is the pendant I told you about in my mail. It's very important to me. Do you know of anyone who could fix it? Leave it to me, my lady. I shall not rest until this pendant is whole again and back in your hands. Thank you. I knew I could count on you, Sackman. Mwah. 
Oh, no. I guess not. Just, just here's my pendant. Well, she's like practically naked. So we need to find somebody to fix a pendant. Do we know any blacksmiths? I know of one. Bloon's father. Do you guys remember Bloon's father? Do you remember that Bloon had a father? Surely you remember that. You would not forget. So from Castle Sassoon, we are headed directly east, and I will meet you there. All right, let's go into Kazis. Talk to uh, ref. Uh, the wow. I almost called her by called Bloon by his official name. Let's talk to Bloon's father, who is uh, Taka. If you guys remember, he is the blacksmith. Surely he can fix the pendant. Back so soon? Is your journey done, or is there something else I can do for you? The princess of Castle Sassoon gave us this pendant. It's broken. Can you fix it, father? Let me see now. Come on, man. You're a blacksmith. I have no idea what this is made of. I've never seen anything like it. Making mythical rams is one thing, but this. No, I'm sorry. I can't help you. Okay, I guess we'll have to find someone else. What? The blacksmith can't do it? That's just bullshit. Oh, before you can get this started, by the way, you do need to send the seven Wi-Fi emails again, so... Yeah, it, really, just just find the game shark code if, if you guys are having trouble to actually replay code or whatever the fancy kids are using these days. Oh, it hasn't been an hour yet. Okay, fine. I'll go back out to the Invincible, wait a couple more hours, and then we can start spamming Taco with mail. Be right back. Okay, I believe it has been an hour, so let's go ahead and talk to... We'll send mail to Taka. View it. There it is, way down here in Kazus. Kazus has recovered well from that gin fiasco. You should come visit when you have the time. That is not what I wanted you to say, so... Another hour it is. Another hour has passed. Let's see if we can send Taka another email. Or regular mail, I guess. We're going through the mod net, I guess. Come on, must be getting old. Hey, that this order from Mithril Gear recently, so I went to the mines to get some more. I must be getting old. I wasn't able to carry it back half the Mithril I used to. That's still not a, what I want you to say. So I have to wait another hour. Another hour has passed. Let's see if I can send something else. Tutaka, please, please answer me the way I want you to. Why is all your stuff so far down? The legendary smith! There we go, that is what I want. I don't know if I've told you, but there's supposed to be this legendary smith wandering the world. Rumor has it that she fixes things so well they look brand new. That is what I want you to say. So we need to go find this legendary blacksmith. Any ideas where she might be? Well, I'll just show you in a second. She's in northwestern Seronia, back on the regular continent, the, 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 the one that's not floating. I don't know what to call it. I, I cannot land here. Damn you. Damn you to hell. Now that I have found a spot that I could land, apparently I was too close to Seronia to land there. We need to go just talk to random people until... Okay, well, we need to talk to women in particular. Because... They definitely said it was a she. Definitely did say it was a she. And no, none of you guys guessed Northwestern Seronia. If you did, you cheated, you damn Googlers. You look like a legendary blacksmith to me. You got gray hair and everything. I am a smith traveling the world in search of a legendary metal. You are the master smith, are you not? I have a favor to ask you. This pendant, can you fix it? It belongs to someone very dear to me. I will do anything you ask. If you can restore it to its previous state. I wouldn't do this normally, but I like the look in your eyes. You're very sexy to me, Saxman. Let me see this pendant of yours. Wait, isn't that the we're getting a new airship sound? Whatever, I'll take it. There, it's all fixed. And we get Sarah's pendant back. Thank you, I do not have much, but what amount of gill would be sufficient for your work? 
Money does not interest me. There is one item, however, that I would like to ask you to find for me. What may that be? Have you ever heard of Orichalcum? It is a measurable of legend, fable death, mystical properties. If you find any of your travels, bring it back to me. Don't worry, I only want to try my hand at tempering it. Whatever I manage to craft the metal into is yours. What do you say? It sounds more than fair. If any Orichalcum we find will be yours to challenge. So now we need to find Orichalcum, but first we need to take this pendant back to Sarah, even though that's technically optional. You can keep it if you want, but but we're taking it to her anyway. Back to talk to Sarah. Here is your pendant, Sarah. You give Princess Sarah her pendant. Thank you, narrator. My pendant, you fixed it. If I may ask, what does that pendant mean to you? It is a keepsake. The pendant belonged to my mother. Thank you, Sackman. Everyone, you can't imagine how much this means to me. And that's it! But... This opens up the next side quest. But this side quest is done! We will take on the next side quest next time! I hope you guys have enjoyed this part of Let's Play Final Fantasy 3. I've been joined, as always, by my ultimate weapon party of Abel, Novin, Bloon, and Sackman. Hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.